Welcome to By The Numbers, I'm FM Tahiti, uh, thanks for joining me for this one, I hope you're well and safe. We've got probably the most important game of Belfast Celtics kind of history, at least with us kind of at the helm. Last game of the season, the last normal game of the season, we need to beat Glenhaven and help Porter down drop points, or there are other possible combinations I think I mentioned previously so if we look at the table just quickly to kind of reassess they're on 32 we're on 31 if they draw that puts them on 33 um if they win that puts them on 35 and there's nothing we can do so if they draw and they're on 33 then we need to win if they lose then we can draw potentially rather than win and still get through on goal difference which is what i think it sorts on yeah, goal difference and then goal scored. Um, so goal difference were better, goal scored were currently better. Um, so that's that. If we lose, we get nothing. If we draw, it depends on what they're doing. If they win, it doesn't matter. So there's that. And we do have our striker swap coming up as well. So we're going to be playing Bonus. And McLaughlin, no, sorry, Bonnie and Deadly instead of McLaughlin and Ward. And if we get points per game, Bonnie is on 1.14 points per game on average. Deadly's only on 0.6, but McLaughlin's only 0.8, and Ward's only 0.8 as well. So actually, Bonnie and Deadly combined. Do you have a slightly better points per game than Ward and Dep uh, Ward and McLaughlin? Um, yeah, see how we do with this. Let's get rid of this filter. That's no good for us. There we are. So let's do a few checks. Up front, we've got Devlin, Bonnest, then we've got Cockcroft. Those are our choice. We've got Dunn, and we've got McGowan. And they all look fine. Then we've got McGreevy but with Wright on the bench and Downey to pick for that. And Wilson, Williamson, Coulter, McGovern and Clark. Coulter's normally on the bench and we normally have McQuitty. There's off some suspension so we'll bring him back in. Uh, can swap them around. It makes much, much difference, does it? Quitty's more on the right, McGovern could play either. Normally have little on it at a Clark as well. Bring him back in. If you want Clark on the bench instead of Rab. Coulter. We're gonna bring Coulter on for instead. Yes, technically Gordon. And that's it. This is our best team. And as you can see, they've not got good partnerships. These three do, because they've played a lot of games together over the past couple of seasons. So we're hoping this will help us, and we're ignoring this. Let's do it. It would be good if Bonis scored, because he's already considered a club icon. So if he could do something to save us, that'd be nice. Um, nope, they don't care. Telling them that we need something. Motivate the strikers at least. Don't care about possession really. Play the Evans recent form has a third in the full table. And we're eighth. Just need one result. All we need, let's get, well, I can't find the latest scores on there, went quick enough. Right, highlights on there. I just, I think I'm blind to it, it's definitely on there, but, pause and find it. There we are, latest scores is a thing. Had a couple of shots already. Cockcroft. 
McGovern, McGowan, get it back in, get it across to someone. Nah. That was not great. Bit aimless. You don't have a good record against them. Honest, let's just close these actually for the moment. Because until we're winning, our poor turn are winning, so it doesn't really matter at the moment at all what we're doing. We'll check periodically. McGovern, oh, of course, penalty. Of course, we're giving away a penalty. Save it. Time to be a hero. No, at least he moved in the right direction, but no. Um, and put down a drawing, so now it matters more, I guess. Also, I think I just realised I said something really stupid at the start of the video. If they draw, then we need to draw. Now, if they lose, we can draw and overtake them. If they draw, we still need to win. At the moment, it's not clear we're going to win. Oof. That was class. Two all draw. Duncanon really going for it. Fire him up. All we can do at the moment. We have to sort of earmark McGovern to come off a of Coulter instead, but not much else we can do. Back there. Cockcroft. Okay. It was just the, the start of the second half highlight. Devlin and Bonis have been pretty quiet. Pour down a Dungan and still drawing. Me two goals as it stands. So McGowan's injured. Let's bring Spence on. And let's bring on Ward for Devlin. Ricky McQuitty's picked up another yellow card. We're just going to, it's one of us ending the season with a whimper. 2 0. Like Duncan and are going to win or something like that now, aren't they? This is the irritating thing in that we could have done it. Just completely lackluster. Sub, sub him because we're going to need him potentially for when we have to go in the relegation playoffs. Unless we can somehow magic up three goals. John Cockroft, long ago, so there's no one there. Ward wasn't even bothering to run for that one. Almost. That was the most interesting and entertaining thing we've done all match. Williamson not getting the tackling. That was a good one though by Dern. Ward. Again. A bit more lively. But it's not making any difference here. None at all. I have a feeling we'll have some suspensions for the next match as well. Puts our misery below the whistle. I was hoping for that kind of like fairy tale great escape. Right at the end. Let's go look at the damage. Dungannon won. All we need to do is draw. Absolute jerkers. Disappointed. Oh, look at that. One point in it. We had a better goal difference. If we just drawn with them. 
or if we just beat the Porter down at any point during the season. Because I don't think we ever did. No, never beat them. Beat Dungannon three times. We only beat one team in the top six. The only time we took any points off them was a draw. Right, so we're going into the relegation group. Look how, look how it's how we've qualified for it. Make it sound positive. Not that we've dropped into it. The board is still delighted that we staved off automatic relegation. Well, don't worry, there's still the chance we could get relegated. Right, stages. No. Rules? So. Which one is it? Two teams. Playoff. Start date 30th, end 3rd. Losing teams relegated. What does that mean? How many legs is that? Two legs last season. And who do we got? So Carrick and Warren Point are playing each other to work out who he's going to be playing against. Us. Can I Warren Point? As Carrick are stronger. And then even the Warren Point have got some good players. Alright, well I guess we'll come back in the next match to see who we've got. It's not the end of the season we're aiming for, kind of heroic escape, but maybe it'd be good for us. We could still survive, we could all be fine, or we could end up back in the championship and have a season where we actually win some stuff. We'll see, we'll have to decide what we do if that happens. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, for sharing my pain, because that was a really frustrating way to end, um, and we'll be back for the next episode. <laughs>